Good morning. It's really cold this morning. It is not. I was a little cold last night. I slept up forward because um, when Ava comes, we've got to share the bed. And Ava's bed is good, but when Pete and I have to share our bed, it's so tight and uncomfortable. Yeah, so Ava's bed's going to be up here, so... And it's much more comfortable when you got your own bed, besides having to share it in a tight, tiny little space, so... I had a good blanket, but then it started getting dewy, and then once it starts getting dewy, it starts getting kind of cold. You're lucky I didn't make you sleep outside. I think this is number 16, maybe this year. Ava's gonna do yoga today, so we're gonna bring her to do yoga, and then Pete and I are gonna go to the phone company and switch over. Pete is gonna get a smartphone. What you got there, Pete? Pete's gonna get a smartphone so he can stop taking over mine. Yeah, uh, we're gonna take Ava to yoga today. Yay, yoga! <sighs> oh, it's gonna be a beautiful day. You already put Layla down the ladder? Huh? You already got Layla down the yeah, ladder? She's in the bus. Good. Is she doing better with going down it? Yeah. She didn't try to jump off? Uh -huh. I think she figured that out pretty quick like. <laughs> and Ava and I are going to work on her bed. So when we get done, um, what I'm going to do is when I drop her off at yoga, I'm going to go to Sailors and get some Sumbrella so that I can make the bed. I'm gonna drop Miss Ava Bean off and then uh, get some umbrella and do a little errands and then I'll be back to pick her up again. Ah. All right, run a few errands. I would love to do yoga, but you know, Ava kind of needs her own time to be herself and not always have parents around. So let her kind of do her own thing for a little while. So I got some textiline and some umbrella. So much for running errands while Ava was doing yoga. The place doesn't open till 10, because Ava's going to be getting out soon. And then we got to drive all the way back. Lovely. Oh no. Keys on. I gotta pee so bad right now, too, on top of this. Oh no! Pete didn't have a phone. Ava didn't have a phone. I don't know. I think I remember switching the key on to start it. But maybe I just didn't switch the key on to start. And now I guess I just wait. I don't know. I, uh, I wanted to go run some errands, but I can't because the place doesn't open until 10, and Ava gets out of yoga at 10.30. I want to work on the bus, too, but we're working on the boat, so that's going to put a damper on the bus a little bit. Right up there is my old beetle. I used to I used to own that beetle. Hey, Pete's got a smartphone now, but yeah. everything's transferred and the girl was learning how to do it, so that taught her how to how to do everything, which was good. And so we're going to head back to the boat. Okay. So we're at Pete's wood shop. I got the plastic so that we can mark Ava's bed, and then we're going to mark it, and then we're going to take the mark, Bye. see ya, and then we're going to put it on the foam and cut the foam out with a turkey cutter. Oh, I'm sorry, Taylor, you can't come. Sorry. Ah, uh, want to get the ball? Ball. <laughs> okay, so i got to get everything all sorted for making this bed. So what I'm really doing is... Um, making a pattern not only for the foam, but also for the pieces. Bumblebee, what are you doing in this boat? 
we're going to turn this into a big bed. So all this stuff is moved. I marked the whole perimeter of where the bottom of the cushion is going to go. And then I took this angulator and marked the angle against the hole. Got that done. That took a while. Pete, we had Pete's backpack the whole time. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay, here's the foam. Actually, the bottom is this though. So the top, the angle goes like this, correct? Okay, we kind of marked the angle. I hope we marked the angle right. <laughs> Um, I put the little angulator on the... <laughs> <laughs> the, electric, the electric knife doesn't work. Crap. Wait, you need that. <laughs> it's a brand new knife. Why does it not work? Okay. Let's try plugging in another outlet. I, I, I put it in like five outlets. Maybe this cord doesn't work, but it works on everything else. So that's the thing that... It's kind of like, what is going on? Put it straight into an outlet without the extension cord, Courtney. Uh, uh, okay. Good. Yeah. Yeah, but I need an extension. Okay, we figured out it's the extension cord. So the only, the only cord. <laughs> Coming to cut your bread. <laughs> like extension cord that would work is this weird fan thing. <laughs> so. Just a point until we got to the angle. Now I need a little bit of help from the master. So we, I tried to uh, put the foam in and it didn't really fit exactly correct. So we're going to cut a few things on the bandsaw. We got to cut the angle a little better on the bandsaw. How you doing, girl? Are you enjoying the shade? I guess. <laughs> she winked at me. Pete's cutting the net right off of the bow spread. What the heck? So there's the net all cut off the bow spread. Pete hey. is also fixing those hose pipes too because they never were screwed or cocked down. Yeah, with the net gone, I can get all that up there to sand. Yeah, true. And we're going to take down those boards there and redo them. And Ava and I are going to redo the nameplates. Because the nameplates were getting kind of worn and... Layla's becoming a Volkswagen dog. She's been hanging out in the Volkswagen all day. Let's get her some food and water, though. Ew, is that Layla's? I don't think so. Thing anyway, in the it's up to you if you cover. want to put it in there or not. How's it look? Wow, this is way more comfortable to sit on, too. Yeah. Umbrella, so that it's up here. So, Pete's working out in the hose pipes, so we're never cocked down. So I figured I'm going to cut the patterns for this. I'm waiting for the hose to come up the ladder and then I'll help fill the water tanks. But while I'm waiting, I'm going to um, start getting the patterns for this. And then I'm going to sit right here and on this cushion, on this very cushion, and I'm going to sew the cover for it. A lot of things are filling. Don't mind me, I'm just marking patterns over here. Whew, I got done making the patterns, and then Pete made us some dinner. We had some spaghetti. 
So now we're doing one last chore and we're heading to Home Depot. Scaffolding. And we while we were looking around, look at this. You don't find this Luon that clear. So we got three sheets of really pretty clear Luon. That'll be perfect for the bus. Hey. 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 You want to eat your breakfast? So, oh, we're back. I'm so glad to be back. I'm tired. The computer was sitting right up there and it slid right out of there. And I'm so lucky that it did not land in Layla's water bowl. It landed in her food bowl instead. You are lucky. I think it just freaked me out more than anything. Like I didn't see any water anywhere. There's really like no water. And when it, it was on when it fell too. Let's just see. I'm scared. Seems like it's working good. I'm just gonna finish up what I got here and then I'm gonna head to the shower and then we're gonna chill out for the rest of the night. Hope you guys have a good night. Oh wait, you guys might not be it might not be night where you guys are. That was a very bad rendition of when they drew the drum roll or whatever. Uh, <laughs> Never mind, I'm so like tired, y'all. Have a good night. <laughs>